Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Romani and if you are new here, hello, welcome. Today we are on day 16 of our 30 days of beauty and that is moisturiser. If you are new here to my channel, I highly recommend that you subscribe to my channel and let's talk moisturisers. I'm just going to show you my three main moisturisers that I am using at the moment. I use so much moisturiser, it's unbelievable. Uh, this is just facial moisturiser. Oh, I could do a body one as well, couldn't I? Hold that thought. Okay, I'm back. I'm back with my body moisturisers as well. So I have got a selection of facial moisturisers, the moisturisers that I'm using at the moment, and I've got some body ones as well. Let's do the body ones first. So the three body ones that I use. So this one here is the Garnier Body Intensive 7 Day Ultra Replenishing Lotion. Hydration felt for up to 7 days. Ooh, hydration. <laughs> uh, this is for very dry skin and it's with a sheer butter. It's still got quite a bit in it but I've used loads. It goes a long way. That is always a winner, especially if you are very, very dry. It's good for your legs. And as soon as I get out of the bath, I'll lava that on. Um, I've nearly finished this. This is right at the end. This is the Human and Kind one that I got from my Fab Fit Fun a while ago. And it took me a while to use it because obviously I've had loads of other ones. Um, this one is all natural and it smells smells like um, cucumber, so it's lovely for the summer, it really is. It's, um, yeah, it smells all summery and cooling and just delicious. And I have this one as well. This is an oil and this smells like a spa it's with uh, mongongo and pomegranate oil. Oh! It makes your mouth water. It smells like a spa, kind of luxurious. It is an oil, just a couple of drops. I pop that on all over, all over my bod. And you smell absolutely frigging delicious. Those are the three main ones that I use on my body. On my face, I've been using this one this one's the one I've been using on my face. This is a Malin and Gotez, whatever, vitamin E facial moisturiser. And it is really nice, that one is. It's really nice. It's very thick. It's kind of like a thick cream slash gel. It's a very strange, strange consistency. And um, as I said, yep, that one has vitamin E. This one, you might have seen a video that I did on this before this is like a dupe for the glow recipe this is the watermelon gel moisturizer it smells amazing i'm actually going to put some of that on right now so it's got a slight pinky tint to it it just smells absolutely like watermelon just feels like feels like it smells like you're rubbing a watermelon on your face um i've already put my sun cream on my face ah brings back to life so where that's a gel as well it's a slightly more cooling and this has also vitamin e niacinamides oh, i can't say that word watermelon extract that's really really nice and I'm really sad. I've nearly used all of this. This is the Pericone MD Revital Rejuvenating Moisturiser, and this has vitamin B, uh, vitamin F blend. This, oh look at it, bougie glass. Look, oh, it smells so fancy. It does smell pretty fancy that one does and it's 
um, you only need a little bit and it's just oh, so nice. This is also, it smells like something you get at a spa. It's blinking amazing. I love it. Um, I'm very sad that it's almost gone. Deeply moisturises, visibly firms, lifts and smooths skin's appearance. It's just great. Um, I don't know, I might have to purchase that. It's quite pricey. It is quite pricey. Um, although I might see um, on your FabFitFun sometimes things like that come up cheaper. So I might just keep an eye out for that and just maybe purchase it when it's on a bit of a cheaper deal as such. Uh, I've used all of my other moisturiser, which was the number seven one that I was talking about the other day. That has an SPF in it, so I've been using that a little bit more. And it is all gone now. I don't think I will repurchase it. I don't think I will. Um, I just don't like the smells. And nighttime creams after I've done my nighttime routine. If I'm not going to bed with a night mask, I've got a couple of not like leave on night masky things, um, like creams and everything, then I will pop on some of this. Um, this is the nighttime cream, so it's a thicker cream. That was the number seven one. And I've also got a Garnier. Garnier Skin Active Moisture Bomb. I love this. I've I've repurchased this several times. And this smells really good as well. It's almost gone. Can you see that little blob at the bottom? And that kind of, I pop that on and I really leave a nice thick coating on my face. So that just soaks right in. Oh! And I have also been using... Oh, I don't know whether I'll be able to find it. I've been using a oil on my face as well. So I have got the number seven one, which I showed you. I've got the ordinary rose, rose hip. And I've got another oil. And where have I put that? That's really nice as well. I don't know where I've put it. I've been tidying up. But yes, so those are the main moisturisers that I use. I want to know what moisturiser is your go-to. Which one have you repurchased over and over and over again? Uh, my one is probably the Garnier one. Um, although that one's just the nighttime one. I have purchased several times the day one as well I just used it all up and I didn't find the need to buy another one because I had quite a few you know other ones that I hadn't used yet so I probably will purchase that because it's a good price and it does make your skin feel really nice uh, anyway thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and I will see you all for the next one bye